Today on the channel, we take a look at the Guardians of the Galaxy Loot Crate subscription service. Welcome everyone, Kyle here, and welcome back to the channel for something different today. Some new ground being broken on the channel as we're going to unbox the brand new Loot Crate exclusive Guardians of the Galaxy collection. Figures, statues, a little bit in between here. We're going to get into them. We're going to see what all the fuss is about, as usual, on the channel and see what we think about these. As this is some new ground broker for the channel. We haven't unboxed any of these Loot Crate exclusive items that are statues, action figures uh, in the past on the channel. And for good news for all my subscribers out there, everybody watching along, I will have a code and a link to these in the description below. Use discount code LEMMY15. Yes, that old KG Corgi Poo Lemmy. LEMMY15. And you will get 15% off these if you are so interested. And like I said, the link will be in the description below. But we're going to do it like we normally do it. We're going to take a look at them. We're going to take a look at the packaging. We're going to talk about it. We're going to unbox it. We're going to talk about it. And we'll see where it goes from there. But this is a four figure statue subscription series Stat, uh, number one right here we're gonna do this one in order we might as well do them in order huh we're gonna go star lord first rocket raccoon number three number two easy for me to count number three gamora and then the latest one shipping here in august is groot everybody's favorite you guys know i love big figures big statues sign me up so i'm sure he'll be a little bit bigger than the rest but we'll see but let's take a look first at star lord let's take a look at the packaging Little square cube box, uh, nice purple colors, nice colors on this one. A thin box, not a super thick box, but it, you can see this is number one in the set, the exclusive Loot Crate items. Um, you can see the Guardians logo down there, Star-Lord, of course, looking only like he can look. What's it say? Star-Lord Collect and Build. So I should mention, these all form together, very much like the Marvel Select Guardians of the Galaxy series we unboxed right here on the channel. I believe those were Disney Store exclusives. The bases and the diorama all collected and connected together. That's what these four do. They all connect together. So we'll see if Kyle is smart enough to connect them once we get them all unboxed. But there it is. Uh, on the top, you got Guardians of the Galaxy. All right, like so. On the back, you got kind of their emblems. There are little logos there for each of the four main characters. Loot Crate original on both sides. And that's about it. So without further ado, let me get the old knife out. Let me cut it open. Let's see what's going on with this Star-Lord. So we got a double bubble mailer in here. Double bubble mailer, double bubble. There's no mailer in here. But there it is. See you later, box. And of course you get the plastic prison here, but it's a double plastic prison. So you know this thing is protected uh, very well. Very well. And it looks really good. Looks very good. So now this is one of these things, you guys know, I'm an action figure guy. That's what I like. I'm not a big statue guy. I don't buy the big expensive statues outside of that Ultimate Warrior one for sure. See you later. However, stuff like this I do like. See you later. A lot of us do work from home now or maybe you work in an office still or somebody like me. I work in both and I'm always looking for things as desk displays. Something that, you know, isn't going to break if it gets knocked over. Something along them lines. And this is the perfect desk display from where I sit. It's a heavy, sturdier plastic. I mean, there's no joints. There's no mobility on this. So it is more akin to a statue. But these are perfect for your desk. Putting on your desk, a little display on your desk. Show everybody you love Guardians of the Galaxy. Or you love action figures. But Star-Lord looking good. I like the looks of that one. It's got the blue tips on the end of his blaster rifle. It looks like Star-Lord. You show this to my daughter and say, hey, who is this? She'll say, oh, that's Star-Lord from the Guardians of the Galaxy. So it looks like the character. That is so important in any kind of figure, be it statue or traditional action figure. Does have his mask on. Like I said, no posability, no removability on these. Uh, but that is the way it goes. It's got the Marvel logo underneath, 2021. So this is a authentic Marvel product for those asking at home. But there it is. There's Star-Lord. All right, number two. Let's get down to it. Rocket Raccoon. And this one will probably be my favorite. You guys know I love little furry creatures. Lemmy, that's the discount code for these if you want to buy these. Lemmy15. Lemmy's a hairy creature. I do love the Ewoks, the Wookiees. You guys know that. My Star Wars love. But then you throw Rocket Raccoon in there. I love a raccoon that talks and shoots guns. What more could you want? He's number two, like I said, in the collection. Loot Crate right there. Adult Collectible, not a toy. 
Yeah, I don't know if kids would really like this. Kids would like this on their nightstand or something like that, but really it's it's not playability. It's uh, more statue than toy is what I would say. This is number two, Rocket, see you later. He's got the plastic prison as well. So these are very well protected in the package. Uh, these are very durable things too. I don't foresee these breaking on us or anything. It's not like, I mean, you can break anything if you try hard enough, but these look to, and feel to be durable enough. We am unbox him, see you later. All right, see you later that way. We'll mix it up a little bit. How does Rocket Raccoon? So this is definitely the uh, comic version of Rocket Raccoon, from my memory at least. He's got a cool jumpsuit on, that blue. Got that yelling raccoon head. Lemmy's met himself a few raccoons over the years. Uh, that's for sure. Fighting in the backyard. He did a recent fight. Him and his sister Domino went after it with a gopher out in the backyard, chasing, nipping on its heels. It was a crazy scene. It was a wild Saturday at uh, Kyle's house. But Rocket Raccoon, I like this one. I knew I would. There was no doubt in my mind. Uh, like I said, I love a furry creature. I love a raccoon, especially when they talk. Sign me up all day long. And this one, you got Rocket screaming mid-scream right there. This also comes with, I'm guessing because Rocket is the smallest character, this would make sense why this one comes with this. But this is the click stand, I believe. I think they all connect, and this is kind of the middle of the statue. You'll have these guys kind of in a circle, and this will be the middle. It says Guardians. Very cool. Let me see if that clicks in. Yep, I was exactly right. So if I can figure it out, anybody can figure it out, if you ask me. So we're going to build this. It's almost like a build-a-figure as you go. So right there, you got two of the four right there built together. You got Star-Lord and Rocket together as usual. So I'll put these guys right over to the side. Because it's time to start with Gamora. Gamora is next in the collection. Very cool. Ages 15 and up on these. But, you know, I think, uh, obviously you have to do that for legal reasons, but I can see some kids having these, like I said before. Uh, you got Gamora on the front, you got the Guardians logo. She is number three in the out of four in the collection. She would be the July edition is Gamora, I believe, with Groot holding up the rear into August. Same uh, carding, very uniform. Uh, I don't know if anybody would want to keep these in the package. Maybe they would, but to me, these are best enjoyed outside of the package, and that's the way I do things. You guys know on the channel. See you later. Whoa, off the top. Got the double the double bubble plastic prison. There's old Gamora. And once again, yes, I believe we're looking at uh, comic book accurate Gamora here. See you later. See you later. That's what it looks like to me. Taking a look at her, looking her over. I mean, yes, it definitely reminds me. This is very... This will go really well with your Marvel Select, as we talked about the Marvel Select. It does come with the hand removed with the, the blade. You just plug that in, of course. Got to line it up right, though. That would be the way to do it. Plugs right in there very easily. So that green skin really pops on hers. Almost looks like She-Hulk, in a way. Almost. But she's... Almost looks like She-Hulk in a way, of the green skin, of course, but she's got her white suit on, she's got her two blades, she's ready to fight, she's ready to throw down at a moment's notice. A very cool mechanical base on these two, I don't know if I mentioned that earlier, but she will connect. She is number three. Oh, we're getting it together. Like I said, these are going to look really good on a desk display. i got to straighten them up a little bit, though. We're getting it there. We'll have some cool glamour shots along the way, as we always do as well. So there they are. The three of them. Very cool. It would be cool to put it on a rotating stand and just see it constantly turning, which you could buy one of those. I don't know if you'd want to, but it's possible you could do it. All right, let me get Groot. This is the one I said I was excited for. Probably Groot or Rocket Raccoon are going to be my favorites. It's just I love quirky, crazy characters. I love hairy, bipedal creatures, and I also love big characters. And Groot, he is a big character. So there's Groot on the front, looking only like he can look. He's a big dude. Very cool. Same packaging. It all, all correlates together, which I like a lot. Collect and build. Original loot crate. There's all the pictures of the four right there. Like I said, he'll be shipping here in August soon, so I get a little sneak peek, which is nice of the loot crate company to send this my way. To give it a little look over. See you later. A little onesie. A little. Oh, we got an arm separate in here. We're going to have to plug it together, but there he is in the plastic prison. Gotta do a little building, just like we did on Gamora. How about the double see you later? See you later. Whoa, hitting the camera. It's the way we roll sometimes. Ooh, this is a good Groot. This is a dark Groot. This is an evil Groot. I don't know about evil, but he definitely looks mad. He's got an angry face going on. I like that a lot. 
I like guys looking more sinister. I'm all for laughing and smiling on my figures, but uh, if push comes to shove, I like more of a menacing, I'm getting ready to fight. Because at the end of the day, these guys are superheroes, they are wrestlers, whatever we're collecting here. Uh, there's always some kind of danger. There's always an element of excitement, and that's what I like. I like some of the expression there, and I do like this Groot a lot. I'm going to have to say it right now. Groot's my favorite of the four. Rocket Raccoon, number two. Star-Lord, three. And then Gamora. Nothing personal, Gamora. Don't take it personal, but you uh, ring up the rear, number four. But this Groot one is awesome, and like I said, this is the latest one. I wouldn't be opposed to just doing this one by itself. I like this one a whole lot. I like Groot, though. I like big figures. I like all that. And this is more comic-accurate Groot to me. But who knows what he'll grow into in the MCU as the series continues and keeps going on. But very solid. Very pointy. It spikes on top. A little a little sharp. That's why it's 15 and up, guys. you got to be careful. And like I said, you can't remove this arm. Let me plug that all the way in. And then he's going to plug right into the rest of the gang. And you got the whole Guardians gang ready to go. They all plug in together. I really like that idea of a base like this. You put them all in here. You put them on your desk. Uh, put them on a rotating spindle. That would be really cool. But look at that. That is pretty solid. That is a pretty solid set. Really cool. The perfect desk display. That's what I think of when I think of stuff like this. This isn't something I'm going to have down here in my man cave. You easily could if you want. Choose your own adventure, as we always say on the channel. But to me, this is the perfect item to put on my desk at work. Uh, you know, I don't have my, I don't know if I'd call my man cave cluttered. I'm not going that far, but my desk at work, you got to keep it clean. You got to keep it nice. I got the Gorton's Fisherman over there. I got Pizza Thor. I got a bunch of Ultimate Warrior figures. And then this is where this Guardians of the Galaxy is going to go right on the edge of my desk. And everybody will come in there and I'm sure they'll take a look and ask about it and have questions. And I'll say, well, you get it at LootCrate.com. Link in the description below. I got a video on it, guys. Use discount code LEMMY15. That's what I'll tell my coworkers. Beautiful boy, Lemmy, Lemmy15. We'll uh, give you a nice discount on these. And you can buy all of them. You can buy one of them. You can buy none of them. It's your choice. Choose your own adventure. But pretty cool. If you're a Guardians fan or you're looking for something for your desk, you can't beat this. What are your thoughts, though, on this? Do you like this? Which one of the four is your favorites? You guys tell me in the comments. Who is your favorite Guardians of the Galaxy character? I'm going Groot. I thought Rocket Raccoon might have stole my heart, but Groot stole it all the way on this one. This Groot is extremely impressive. The whole thing's pretty impressive for what it is. Obviously, not an action figure, but for a statue at a reasonably priced, cheaper statue for your office work, that's where I'm planning on doing it, sign me up all day long. I'm all in. I'm all in on it. So, But you guys tell me your thoughts and your comments, and let me know if you've ever bought anything from Loot Crate in the past. And while you're here, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. We're unboxing things all the time. You guys know that. We'll probably have more Loot Crate things in the future, so be prepared for that. Marvel Legends, uh, AEW, WWE, NECA Ninja Turtles, you name it, we run the gamut on the channel. There's always something new, always something popping, so make sure you're subscribed. Don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to follow me on social media at SirPaul64 on Twitter, the underscore Kyle underscore Peterson on Instagram. And then if you're interested in this uh, loot crate item of the Guardians of the Galaxy, make sure you hit the link in the description below and make sure you put in discount code LEMMY15 to give yourself a discount. Why would you not? Uh, you'd be a fool not to, as one might say. So there you go for the loot crate exclusive Guardians of the Galaxy click and connect set. I'm Kyle. See you guys all real soon.